智化漫天飞舞，让人肾上腺素飙升的电竞赛正式落幕。长达两个月，全世界最大的电竞嘉年华 Gamers Eight 画下完美句点。I never really imagined that Saudi could have esports here, uh, because East, Saudi has kind of always had a negative reputation, and like in esports, we've never really gone far, even though many players have had the chance before. But now, since there's been many changes, for example, now we have a lot of strong rosters in Rocket League. Uh, we have a lot of more credential acclaim to esports. 这场在沙地阿拉伯的游戏全盛会大咖云集，寄出千万美元的大奖，等着各路英雄好汉一较高下。We do have the 45 million dollar prize pool. It is cumulatively the world's largest. However, it is distributed among tournaments. One of our largest tournaments this year is Dota 2. Dota 2 will have a 50 million dollar prize pool on its own. 愿意砸下这么多钱办电竞赛事，就是看上全球高达三十亿的游戏玩家，而且预计相关商机会从今年的两千两百七十亿美元，四年后增加到三千一百二十亿美元。Effectively, you're bringing in the top talent, the top gaming developers, publishers, players, putting them in state-of-the-art facilities and studios. The Saudi government is really trying to propel this industry to new heights, and not just, you know, be visible in this. 不只是想短时间吸引大批玩家以及选手到访，沙特阿拉伯有心在电竞产业上发展。掌握实权的王储萨尔曼自己本身就是经典射击游戏《决胜时刻》的粉丝，去年还宣布用国家公共基金成立电竞小组，发展电玩游戏产业。In early 2022, we saw the uh, the creation of Savvy Games Group, which effectively was given a, a approximately 38 billion dollar war chest to effectively invest. In、uh, in everything gaming and esports related. 在幕后推动的还有少坦亲王，目标就是要推动电玩产业创造超过台币四千两百七十亿的商机。Our outlook by 2030 is to have a GDP contribution in Saudi of roughly 50 billion Saudi riyals,、uh, which will roughly be around one percent. Of the of the GDP, but it's a growing、uh, industry worldwide. So to be a additive part of that as Saudi with our community, with our investments, not just here but globally, is something that's very important to us. 不只是豪气收购知名游戏厂商，更有意培植本土业者，要成为中东游戏产业的领头羊 Some of our overarching、um, uh, KPIs in the national strategy for gaming and esports are. Not just the GDP contribution, but 40,000 jobs created, 250 companies based in Saudi, both local and regional headquarters. 赵坦亲王也曾经与台湾签署合作备忘录，促进双方在电玩产业的交流。野心勃勃，跻身要成为全球十大电竞重镇之一。One of the most important things that we've been looking at is how do we really become by 2030 a global hub for gaming and esports. You know, when people think about gaming, you think about Japan and Tokyo. You think about Seoul and South Korea. You think about, you know, Burbank in California. We want Saudi and Riyadh and Gedea to be a natural part of that conversation. 积极迈向二零三零年目标，沙特阿拉伯誓言要把电竞产业打造成向足球引起全球追捧的职业赛事，将娱乐软实力转化成不输化石产业，源源不绝的金流。特别新闻综合报道。想看最完整的新闻内容，记得下载 TBS 新闻网 APP。